going away? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD Blind. In last episode, we did a bunch of Killer B side quest related stuff. Then we're off in front of Dampa over here, though we haven't talked to you yet. So I'm feeling pretty good. Why? Because I recently got myself a pet pig. Three, in fact. I got a black splotch pig, too. Now, how often do you see one of those? Not often, chum. I let, I let them ashore to gaze over yonder, but the thing is, I can't stop worrying about the little guys. Okay. Hey, just so you know, if you ever have money issues, I give good financial advice. You come talk to me anytime, chum. I may not look rich, but I've got plenty of cash. Okay, I want to talk to you. <laughs> what? What? Well, he said he's worried about his pigs. Black splotched pig, in fact. Let's bring him one. I, I thought he just had to talk to him to start this, but maybe we don't. No, I want to crouch. No, crouch. Stop being scared of me, Mr. Pigu. There we go. See if this will do anything for you, huh? Look, it's your pig. Drop him. <laughs> no, no, no! Oh man, come on. Hey, what? I'm talking to you. I give a good fact. Oh, do we miss out playing a mini game with him? If you talk to him the first time you come here, he um lets you play a mini game where you gotta find one of his pigs. Oh, chum, that's a skull necklace. But anyways, show him a skull necklace. I don't have no idea of how you're supposed to know this. He never, like, indicates it anyway. I click these things, but how'd you know that? I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know how I knew that. I could sell these things for huge profit at antique stores, which reminds me, there's something I want to talk to you about, chum. Could you give me at least three of them? If you do, I'll let you play a really fun game. Ah, why not? Thanks, chum. I'm happy to take them off your hands. All right, then. Now, I'll let you play my little game. It's called Piggy Sitting. I've got three pigs loose on this island. You have to bring them all back with me in two minutes. If you do a good job, I'll reward you for your trouble. Are you ready, chump? Absolutely. Okay, so this is not the same game. All right, bring them to me within two minutes. Starting now. Ready? Go! Oh, it does respawn. I'm like, well, I mean, the pig I already threw over here is kind of already here. All right. Oh, no. Oh, what? I couldn't crouch. There we go. All right, so we have two minutes. <laughs> it's funny how they fart. Yeah, they're actually farting. Like, there's no... If and... Yeah, see if we stop. Yeah, it, it's weird. There we go. Oh, -ho! the first one arrives. We've got a minute 38 left, chum. Oh, are they hidden elsewhere? There's one... Oh, there's one over there. Okay, well, there's one up here as well, I believe. So the game we could have played before that I apparently missed was if you talk to him when you first get to Windfall Island, the very first time when you're looking for the sale... Uh, he'll let you play a mini game where you gotta find one pig. It's like it's different from the others. I don't know how, but it's different. And you'll bring him one of his three pigs. Like, nope, not that one. But then you'll bring him another one. And be like, oh, it's that one. Here's 50 rupees or whatever. I, I don't know if it's actually 50 rupees. It's something like that. Second one shows up. Well, chum, there's only a minute, 34 minute and four seconds left. Okay, well, so let's go grab this last one. It's pretty freaking easy. Whoa, his ears like glitching out. <laughs> So, I don't know, maybe he'll let me play it after I give this last one to him? Question mark? I don't freaking know. I didn't play it last- Like, I, the only reason why I know about this- Wow, you found the third one! Nice work! Well, chum, you win! Oh yeah, I guess promise is a promise. I owe you a little roar, don't I? Alright, hold out your hand, chum. You got your shirt- sure. Aw, oh, dang it. Open this on the map screen? Yeah, that sucks. I was hoping for a heartbeat. But still, cripes! How can my little piggies lose like that? You must be out of shape. Time for an exercise regimen. Uh, things will go so easy for you next time. So yeah, try to try. Hmm. So he doesn't let you play. Well, that's really weird. I wonder why not. Okay, there's one thing I want to try here, because I am kind of really wanting this. <laughs> I want to get another hard container before I go to next temple. Um. So I think I might get another. Oh, I do get another mail mail thing. Take a look what this is. Good evening. Let's think we have one letter. Here's the letter. Yay! Not cod anymore. To my son superior. Thank you so much, very much for looking after my boy. This isn't much, but I hope you'll accept it all the same. I politely request you, your continued kindness toward my son, Kashiko, Kashiko, Beto's mother. If you're wondering, who the heck is that? You got a heart, piece of heart. You collect these, so very click one more and increase your life energy with one heart. If you're wondering who the heck that is, that's the guy that just mailed us and said, well, actually in the last episode where he said, hey, you're amazing with your 25 letter sorting thing. Here's 20 rupees, ha ha ha, even though I had to pay 10 rupees if you freaking even get the letter. I don't know funny if I had to pay more than how much money I got. 
But um, that's his mother thanking us for being great and stuff. And so, yeah, that's a piece of heart. Now, it's time to get the second treasure charm here, which I'm not looking forward to at all. I'm not going to read this again. I already did. I kind of wanted to, but whatever. <laughs> so, I've gotten a heart piece here, once for beating it in under 24 shots, and then I got another treasure chart in here for also being under 24 shots. Now, the current record is 20 shots. You still get 24 cannonballs, but if you beat it in under 20 shots, you get another treasure chart. It's going to be this way. Alright. Take a look here. Oh, man. Not doing so hot, you guys. Seriously, it's all luck based. There's no way to know where the heck it could possibly be. And none of these are not very well placed shots. And I lose. Great. Right here. Nope. Splish. You'll, you'll occasionally hear me or other Let's Players who say splish. This is exactly where that comes from, this game. Oh, uh, bad news. Uh, enemies were cheated or something. <laughs> Well, at least we have a lot of cannonballs. We don't have to worry about anything anymore. The only thing is kind of... Ooh, lucky shot. <sighs> Sucks. Alright, now you also have to be careful because, like, even though, yeah, that's one, but for all I know, that could have been the three or the two, and it could, like, extend another way. I actually saw Game Drums playing this uh, when they took on this, and that happened to them, and I didn't even think about that possibly happening before. Um, it's kind of a shame they don't tell you exactly like at what point one stops so that could really like chip, chip you up for no reason other than just because the game's being a dinkleberg Dinkleberg. Oh, there's no way to win this. All right Yay one shot dang it. Ah oh, that two 20 shots I gotta do this in all right. I'll see you guys in a second. I'll probably just fast forward my successful attempt or something and maybe talk over it if it's short enough. See you guys in a second. Or long enough, I guess. <gasps> oh my god, you guys. I might have get it. Oh no. Oh no. Which way? Yes, I did it! Holy crap. Thank the Lloyd. Oh, look at that. That is pure luck. Look, you can only miss two, four, wait, two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven times. <laughs> Excellent work, sailor. Your deeds have successfully protected the peace on this fair island. We are very proud. The children on the Ivan would like to thank you, sailor. Yay, yay, yay. Oh, thank you, Mr. Sailor. Please accept all of our combined allowances. Take these 50 rupees as your reward. Hooray for money. No! Are you serious? Oh, you have to be under 20 shots? I thought just 20 shots would be good. Oh, man. I was so happy, you guys. Oh. See you guys later. Holy crap! My first two shots. Oh my glory, I might have a good chance here. Oh, look at that! We did it! 14 shots. Holy good. Thank you. Game. I don't know. I kind of feel like I made it easier the longer I went because each time it would be like I'll get the first squid in like my first few shots. Excellent work, Sailor. Your deeds have successfully protected the peace on this fair island. We are so very proud. The children on this island would like to thank you, Sailor. Hooray! Yay, yay, yay! Thank you, Sailor! Please accept the. What? What? Oh, there we go. Whoa, wait a second. 14? Hey, that's a new record. So, uh, you get this too. Oh, I, like, had a mini panic attack that I was like, are you serious? You got to change chart. So, uh, thanks for playing all that. I can't tell you how fun it's been for me, and, uh, don't forget your umbrella or nothing on your way out. Yeah, shut up. I hate you. Thank God we're done with that mini game. That only took, uh, my recording's at 25 minutes. So, what's that? Mm, a good 15 20 minutes which actually isn't that long to be fair 
It feels that long, all right. <laughs> oh, good lord. Okay. Back to daytime. Oh, I thought I played that on for a second there. Okay. So, I believe we need one more heart piece. Yes. I believe... Actually, I'm pretty... I'm like 90% sure we do. So, since I do want one more heart container before I go on to the next temple, I have decided I'm going to do this side quest right now. I don't, do I have a picture of this girl still? I don't. Okay, I have a picture of the moon still. <laughs> and... Alright, so, I think we have to, I don't look this up, so I could be wrong here. We're going to take a picture of this lovely lady. It says good, so that's great news bears. I'm going to go show it to Mr. Anton over here, since if you remember, actually, did she say anything different now? Let's take a look. Now it's been some time. Hey, I've had something on my mind ever since the picto pictographer who lives in the red brick building told me my fortune. Tell me if I see a beautiful pictograph of myself. If I send a beautiful pictograph of myself to the one who has captured my heart, true love will blossom in return. So I can help that notice you have that picto uh, box of your own, don't you? Do you think you could take a pictograph of me in, in the apple of my eye? Maybe you'll notice my affections. Leave it to me. Really? How splendid! Be sure to get my good side. Oh, I want to show off this outfit, foot, so make sure not to get on my pic. Take a pictograph of my face. Can you get my whole body in the picture? Can I show it to you? No. Okay, so I guess I'm just going to go show it to the dude. Interesting, she has a flat chest. <laughs> Do all the girls have a flat chest in this game? I'm not entirely sure. Do you say anything? There's certain someone that I've had my eye lately. I don't know her name, but boy, oh boy. Whenever I think about her, my heart just starts fluttering in my chest. I've never felt anything like this before. You think I'm, like, you think I'm catching a cold, buddy? I think you're in love. Okay, you say the same thing. Great. Show you the pictograph. <laughs> I don't know. She's like, like, she's like hey. <laughs> Oh, a pentagraph, eh, buddy? Yeah, this girl. Actually, buddy, this is the girl I've had my eye on lately. Wow, she really is that pretty. I mean, just seeing this pentagraph reminds me of how gorgeous that girl is. But no, I'll never be happy with just a mere pentagraph. Never. I can't just masturbate with that. I need a lock of her hair as well. That's it. I made my decision. I'm going to go get that girl to go out with me. I've got to get it done, buddy. i got it. Maybe I'll invite her to join me at the cafe bar for coffee, of course. So what's her name, anyway? Do you think she's nice? Does she have a steady fel- Does she have a steady fellow? Oh, I'm so nervous! That's it, I've made my mind. First, I'm gonna ask her out for coffee, and then if things seem to be going right, I'm gonna prof profess my love for her. <laughs> Jeez, ugh. I just can't seem to settle down. I'm so nervous. I mean, just when am I supposed to invite her out, buddy? Um, uh, I don't know. Good question. Uh, I don't know if I need this picture graph, but I'm gonna- Okay, it's good. Awesome. I'm gonna take that just in case I need to show her it or something so she could fall even more in love. I, I don't know. I don't think I need it, but just in case. Maybe he'll come tomorrow. Tomorrow, hey? Hmm, let's try changing it tonight or something. <laughs> See what happens. I'm actually not entirely sure. Let's make sure. I mean, they did say they're gonna go to the cafe. Let's go see if they're there now. Mm hmm. It'd be cool if occasionally when going in and out of buildings, like it would change from night to day. I mean, not every time. It would be cool if that was like, it was a way to pass time as well. Are they in here? They are not. Great. Let's go back outside. Change it back to day. Maybe that'll do something for a, for a, yeah, huh? Ooh. I almost did the, Oh man. <laughs> How do you play songs? I don't freaking know. Really happy in this game isn't like Ocarina of Time where they have to like reset the entire town. They put you at the beginning of the town. Um. <gasps> She's gone. Are they in the cafe now? Are they on a little datey date? A little date date. <laughs> Makes me sad. We're actually nearing the end of all the side quests on Windfall Island here. I mean, we still have a few. Oh, did I see orange. Did I see orange. Oh, that's cute. Say anything about this? Oh, can I help you with something? Let's talk. No, this world's a crazy place, kiddo. You're still young, so you probably don't know about what goes on out there beyond the com comfortable confines of your home. That's it. Do you even need a let's talk dialogue there? Look at this. We have the cute couple, and then we have this asshole over here. <laughs> hey, it's you. Listen to this, will you? I did it. I worked out my courage, and I talked to her. And it was totally the right move. You know why, buddy? She likes me. She actually likes me. Aw, it's adorable. The two of us are going to start dating. Don't we make a delightful couple? 
I'm so happy, and that's why I want to share some happiness with you. You got a piece of heart, that's a fourth piece. Uh, completing another heart container, your life energy has increased by one heart. You could take good care of it. Oh, I will. Everything's coming up, Millhouse. I mean, everything's coming up roses for me. Life is good, buddy. Jeez, you know nothing was good beforehand? You delivered my pictograph, didn't you? Well, it looks like it was what brought us together. Thank you so much. Aw, so cute. Does anyone have any, like, thing to say about these cute couple? Nah, uh, yeah, I talked to you about that already. Anything? Really? Nothing at all? This probably- I feel like that girl- that girl looks really familiar. Is she from another game? Is she from another, like, Zelda game? I just don't remember. Is it like a- I mean, maybe like Majora's Mask where there's that milk bar? Like, is she maybe the, the waiter there or some crap? I don't freaking- is a waiter? Is that the right term for that? I don't know, like, cashier doesn't seem right for, like, Batista maybe? I think that's what those people are called? Coffee shop related people? I just want to see if, um, do Anton and Linda stay in the cafe now, or do they, are they, like, on constant dates forever? <laughs> are they going to be outside again? I kind of hope they're outside still. I like, oh. Oh, I thought that was Anton over there. Oh, there's over here now. That's adorable. Okay, I like that they're outside. I'm so happy. And you, Linda, you're so swell. Aw. Thanks to you, Anton and I have grown close to one another. Thank you so much. What about you? Say anything else? Nope. I'm so happy. You're so swell. <laughs> Alrighty, let's get out of here. This is disgusting. Yeah, that's our second roll of hearts. Finally, we're like at the end of the game here and we're just getting our second roll of hearts right now. It's weird for me to be staying right near the end of the game. Um, actually, we're gonna go to Tingle Island here. There's one last thing I want to do before we hit off the next and final real temple of the game. Oh boy, that's so weird for me to say. Let's go. I mean, we still have plenty left in this game, especially with collecting the eight triumph works. That's right, there's eight. There's two island. Um, oh, it was weird. I did not expect to see that dude there. Okay, we're going to open up Beetle's map again here. Oh, no. Beetle. There we go. Ah, so he's one square west of here. It's one square west for us of here. Oh, nope. All right, I am going the correct way. So this island over here. Is it that one over there? It's gotta be that one, I think. Did you hear Georg? Jeez. You can't swim as fast as me. Holy crap. Okay, maybe you can. <laughs> it's kinda funny to see him do that. Whee! Oh, there's an island platform right there. And there's also a whirlwind going around there. I feel like there's probably something important in there. Seeing how much like depth is in them. Seriously, dude, you're still following me? Get a life, God. Wow. Wait, did that hit me? No! Where the heck is the island for this place? What? What? Oh, it is this. Okay, I'm actually just closer to this than I thought. I felt like we were just about to leave the square. The last we were not. Hmm, interesting looking place. Is there a fish anywhere around here? Meh, fish, where are you, meh? No. Okay, well, whatever. We'll be here again anyways. So, we'll get the fish then, I guess. Oh, there's a real fish. Maybe somewhere. Oh, no. All right. That's too far away for me to want to swim all the way out there. Might as well use our amazing tail. I was going all slow there. That was weird. All right, jump out. Beetle, don't push me, you butthead. Jeez. Okay. So, you'll see the ship actually looks a bit different. There's curtains all around it to hide all the mysterious things. <laughs> hey look, it's not Beetle, it's... Oh, a fine welcome to you, young person that I've never seen before. You're so lucky to meet me at this time. The shop will close in just seven more days and I'm having a clearance sale. So, he says seven more days, but it never happens. Empty bottle, MSRP, this is my last one. I don't know what MSRP means. My super ripped penis. Got it. This empty bottle is a mere 500 rupees. Buy it, buy it, buy, buy, buy. I'll buy it, why not? Oh, thank you so much. You're happy, I'm happy, we're all happy. <laughs> How much is that? Piece of heart, open price. It's my last one of these too. 950, nope, cannot buy that one. 
Current chart, current price. <laughs> Why does it say it like that? Price may be high, but it'll pay off handsomely in the end. Chart chart is just 900 rupees. Buy it, buy it, buy, buy, buy. Nope. Bye. Come again. So yeah, this is like the special beetle shop. I, I, I don't get it, but okay. <laughs> it's weird that they just didn't have like another different guy, like have a shop somewhere else, like Beatles rival or something that would have been cool but this is cool too i mean it's also funny so i'm okay with this not jpeg is there seriously still no fish like i'm not gonna even get it at this point because i'll be getting it eventually anyways i really that is so weird oh there he is over there well it's too late now <laughs> okay so in the next episode we're gonna go to outside islands and we're gonna go get grandma soup grandma soup and then we're gonna go back to uh, the mother and child island and we're gonna get two fairies since we have a total of three bottles now and then we'll head off to the next temple holy crap you guys so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll talk to you guys later bye bye just you know what? let's end off on the outside islands let's go see mommy 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 uh, mommy i mean grandma not mommy <laughs> See you guys later.